you have the times table of 2 written. There are two different ways of writing it down. In this way, the number 2 is in the first position in all the questions. And here we have 1, 2, 3 all the way till 10. And the answers are in 2's. That means it's like skip counting in 2's. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14 onwards. In this format, the first place is taken by numbers from 1 to 10. The second number that you are multiplying is 2 in all the questions. And the answer here remains the same, which is counting, skip counting in 2's, 2, 4, 6, 8. Why I'm telling you this is to notice that the number we are adding and multiplying here, which is 2 and 1, here we are multiplying 1 and 2. When we multiply two numbers and if we change the position of the numbers we are multiplying, the answer remains the same as it does here in 2 and 2. The answer is 2. 2 1s are 2, 1 2s are 2. If you look at this example, 2 7s are 14. 7 2's are 14. We are changing the position of the numbers we are multiplying. The answer does not change. It stays the same. Now, I'm going to show you what actually is the difference between this format and this format. We need to remember that in multiplication, always the first number is the number of sets you need to make. Let's take this example. 2 4's are 8. We are going to make 2 sets. 1 2. In each set, the set size is 4. So in each set, we need to put 4 balls each. If you count all of them together, the answer is going to be 8. 4 plus 4 makes 8. If we take the same example, which is here, 4 times 2 is 8, we will see here we have to make 4 sets. Because the first number is 4, we make 4 sets. And the set size is 2. The answer remains the same which is 8. Here we have 2 4s are 8. Here we have 4 times 2 makes 8. 4 3s are 3 4s are. Here again the numbers that we are multiplying we have changed their positions. We are going to see after we make the sets that the answer is going to remain the same. So it will show if we change the position, in place of 4, we put 3, and in place of 3, we put 4, we change the positions, the answer does not change. The first number is the number of sets. We have 4 sets here. In each set, we are going to draw 3 objects, which are stars in this case. I will do skip counting in 3s. 3, 6, 9, 12. You can also count in 1s. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. The answer is going to be the same. Here we have the question 3 times 4. We have 3 sets here. In each set we draw 4 stars. This shows that if we change the place of numbers that we are multiplying, the answer does not change. 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. The answer remains the same. Whenever we are multiplying, it's best to an extent, to a stage, we can make sets and solve multiplication questions. But the best thing is to start learning your times tables of 2, 3, 4, 5, all the way till 8 or 10. That's going to be the best because it's going to help your uh, calculation speed and you're going to be perfect in your answers as well because you've memorized them.